just wait for my roommate to get here. Whoa. You invited Jordan here? Yeah. To a place where people eat? <laughs> Liz, are you angry with me? <laughs> Liz has this idea that Jordan and Chow might make a nice couple. <sighs> nice couple of what? You and she's not so bad. She has no social filter, Liz. She says whatever's in her head. Let's see how you can stand it. Hey, guys. Hey. Oh, you are so freaking hot. <laughs> My sister used to have a dress just like that. I really got a poop. Yeah, Jordan's a mess. Hey, guys. I'm a mess. <laughs> the head dermatologist at work had this one patient, and I had to drain his infected boil. I mean, I'd seen white pus and yellow pus, but I'd never seen purple pus. Do they have pudding here? Vivid as always, Jordan, at the risk of being rude, I'm going to walk away abruptly. Ooh. Um, excuse me. You didn't happen to see a charming Englishman around that thinks you're beautiful. Oh, here I am. No offense, but I really don't like being hit on when I'm eating. Well, what do you got there? Half a bowl? Oh, wait. Excuse me, I gotta scratch my crotch for a minute. Hey, what are you doing there, scratching your crotch? I know that tune. <laughs> Chow, this is my roommate, Jordan. Jordan, this is our friend, Chow. Uh, Chow, Jordan here just lanced some boils. Ah. Jordan, Chow here just made poop. <laughs> points for self-confidence but I don't date guys in their 20s now who's hitting on who I'm 35 I told you this was a good idea mm -hmm. I gotta admit kind of seem to like each other Can I switch seats with you, Liz? I, I, I seem to be catching splatter. <laughs> they say I gotta be a man. And I'm halfway there, halfway there. They say I'm having too much fun. But I don't care, I don't care. This is the time. It's going fast. How much is too much? Or not enough? There's so much stuff. I don't know. Ah, well, hello. Hey. I just spent the most amazing afternoon with Gretchen. Mike, she's wonderful. Is it true what they say about sex with older women? Oh. <laughs> I don't know about that yet, but, uh, I hope to rectify that by this evening. You said rectify. <laughs> Mike, you're so immature. Uh, all right, so uh, how old is this dame anyway? She's 45. She's just 10 years older than me. Well, than my make-believe age. <laughs> it's actually a real challenge, you know, accounting for my lost decade. So I've put together this little cheat sheet. <laughs> you fought in the Falklands War? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's a much bloodier conflict than most people realize. Really? <laughs> so, Gretchen's coming over this evening for dinner, and since the only 35-year-old men who live together are the ones who live together, I was wondering if you wouldn't no, mind... No, no way. Oh, my, come on. You can just go over to Liz's. Come on, I cleared out for you that time you had all those people over. Oh, when you blew off my birthday party so you go out and buy some pants? <laughs> Did I do that? Yeah. I don't recall. But, you know, they say that the memory's the first thing to go. <laughs> Liz, I think I'd be great in a war, okay? I could be one of those special forces guys, you know? <laughs> oh, my God. Hi, guys. Oh, Jordan, I, I am sorry. I didn't know you'd be asleep so early. Oh, I'm not sleeping. I've been having sexual intercourse. <laughs> Why didn't you use our signal with the yellow bandana on the door? Ahoy, matey! <laughs> Jordan, remember our little talk about taking things slowly? Yeah. 
I completely disregarded that. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> Watch it. That is our new kitten. Jordan and I bought him together after an early bumpy patch in our relationship. So we named him Bumpy Patch in our relationship. Mm. <laughs> relationship? You guys have known each other like 18 hours. Actually, it is 26 hours right now. Happy, Happy anniversary! anniversary. Oh. Uh, hey. Hey, guys, come on. Jeez, Mike. It's not like we were having sexual intercourse. <laughs> What are you, a health teacher? You know what, Mike, let, let's just go to my room. No, it's only 8 o'clock, and you don't have TV in your room. Mm. Oh, hey, I know. You guys stay out here, and we can have hot, sloppy coitus in Liz's bed. <laughs> <laughs> like we did after we watched Judge Joe Brown. <laughs> God. Ah! All hands on deck! Chow Beard is digging for sunken treasure! <laughs> What a night. I haven't danced like that since I was 25. Oh, me neither. <laughs> oh, Gretchen, where do the years go? I would have loved to have seen you at that age. I bet you were delicious. <laughs> well, I had a little bit more hair. <laughs> a little bit less of a paunch, but uh, I was pretty tasty. Mm. You're still pretty tasty. Mm. And you haven't even tried my tasty parts. So bad. Mm. Hold that thought. I need to go to the ladies' room. Oh, great. Well, uh, I'll fetch you some snifters of Sambuca. <laughs> hey, you know, as a uh, as a 35-year-old man, do you know what I really miss? <coughs> Actual bank tellers. None of this ATM nonsense. And uh, oh, my flock of seagulls haircut. God, do I miss that. <laughs> But you can't tell that to the kids of today with their pierced nipples and virtual reality gloves. Ewan, whose room is this? Bucker. <laughs> oh, um, uh, yeah, this, this isn't a room. This is, uh, actually a piece of art I had commissioned. It's, uh, it's called Random Crap on Walls. Uh, by Marcel von Duchenhauser. Ewan, what's going on? All right, Gretchen, look, I, I haven't been entirely frank with you. But the honest truth is I have a... a son. <laughs> Billy. Well, then why is there a sign on the wall that says Mike's room? Well, his name's Billy Mike. Uh, we're from the deep south of England, but, but uh, I, I just call him Mike. You and stop. I see what's happening here. You hid your child from me because you were afraid it would scare me off. Yes. <laughs> yes. Well spotted. That's it. And I'm... I'm sorry. You and I love children. Well, they are our future. Mm. <laughs> So how old is Mike, anyway? Uh, six. Teen. Six to sixteen. Uh, randy little bugger. <laughs> but safe. Yeah. You know, when we first met, you seemed sort of... immature. No. But <laughs> any man who's this committed to being a single parent as you are... I just think it's sexy. Well, I, I love him so damn much. <laughs> God's sake. Chow, stop jumping on the bed. <laughs> Come here and have sexual intercourse with me. It's just so springy. I can't resist. Can you resist these? Wow, even springier. <laughs> let, let, let's just ignore them. Chow. What? Joe! What? Oh, Joe! What? I am right here on top of you! How dare you! You had 
actually think Owen Wilson is hotter than Luke Wilson? Oh, God. Owen Wilson is twice as hot as Luke Wilson. Mike, if you love me, you'll kill me. Luke has a smoldering intensity. Wait, wait, listen, they're fighting. Owen looks like vomit. <laughs> I don't think this is working out. I don't even know who you are anymore. They're breaking up. This is fantastic. I love you. I love you too. It is over. Fine. Why don't you go hang out with your friend Mike, who happens to be terrible at oral sex? <laughs> I swear I never touched her. Vile harpy! Do not spread lies about Chow's bro. It's not a lie! Liz told me! <laughs> she's gone! Ooh, she's gone! She's gone! She's gone! Gone! Don't ask for any more water. <laughs> so, look, anyway, Liz said that uh, initially, when we first started, when did you get glasses? When I turned 31. I only need them for reading and night driving. Now, go on, I'm listening. <laughs> oh, I guess I can't have nice things. <laughs> All right, Grandpa, fine. Now, look, Liz told Jordan that I wasn't so good at a certain sexual act. Ah, you mean the voyage to the netherworld? Yeah. <laughs> Enjoying the 30-second flavor. Said yes. I know, I know, but I'm sorry, Mike. I've got a hundred of these. Look, look, don't beat yourself up, okay? It's a very confusing place down there. Oh, I know, dude. It's like the subway system. You gotta ride around for a while before you get your bearings. <laughs> but no, no, that, that, that's not the point. The point is, Liz violated the sanctity of our sex life. Oh, Mike, come on. I seem to recall you telling me that she snorts when she climaxes. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Like a pig. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh no, no, dude. It's like, ah, 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 ah. Oh, crap. What? It's just that I was really getting off on being genuinely mad at her. I mean, I'm finally right. When's that gonna happen again? What do you mean, happen again? It hasn't even happened now. <laughs> Just don't say anything to Liz, all right? I really want to milk this a little. Well, they say the hardest thing is letting young people make their own mistakes. <laughs> Three for ten dollars. This old thing is getting old. Oh, Mike, it's so worth it. Gretchen is so deep. So why? So complex. Oh, she had sex with you last night, huh? Yeah. <laughs> but Mike, it's like when she touches me, it's like she really knows me, you know? There's, there's no secrets. It's just pure honesty. And she gets really hot when I talk about my teenage son. Here, check this out. You have an imaginary son and you bought him a ball and glove? <laughs> Mike, I'm staying in that boy's life and I'll be damned if I'm going to make the same mistakes my father did. <laughs> Is this good? Am I rubbing them the right way? It's better when you get in between the toes. <laughs> See, Liz? I tell you what I like. That way you don't have to guess. You're still pretty mad, aren't you? Not mad. Just disappointed. <laughs> My cookie's ready yet? <laughs> so I, I thought it was orange juice, but it turned out to be a urine sample. You did not! <laughs> no, 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 you guys cannot be back together again.
again. Oh, please. That is so earlier today. We discovered that we're better friends than lovers that have sexual intercourse. For God's sakes, woman, mix in some slang. So anyway, I fixed Chow up with my friend Jamie. And I fixed a Jordanator up with my friend Jed. In fact, right now, we're on a double date. <laughs> these tongues in my tiny apartment. Jed, Jamie, Mike, Liz. Oh, Mike. Yeah, yeah, I heard a lot about you, man. You're, you're the guy that's pretending to be 35 so you can go out that older woman, right? No, 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 that's my roommate, Ewan. Oh, I thought Ewan was the one who's totally lame at traveling down under. <laughs> no, that's me. So who's the one who's dating the girl who snorts like a pig during sex? You are so intercoursed. <laughs> you can keep your Carson daily. For my money, nobody introduced a Spandau Ballet video quite like J.J. Jackson. <laughs> you really like reminiscing about the 80s, don't you? <laughs> you should have seen me back in the 80s. I used to really reminisce then. <laughs> oh, people just don't reminisce like they used to. <clears throat> oh. Hey, I'm sorry to interrupt. Hey, uh, I'm Mike. Mike, I'm Gretchen. I've heard so much about you. <laughs> He's 16? Huh? Looks more like 14. <laughs> <sighs> well, his mum smoked during pregnancy. <laughs> we didn't know back then. Good night. Oh, you don't have to rush off. Why don't you hang out here with me and your dad? <laughs> oh, my dad. <laughs> Hi, dad. <laughs> I'd love to hang out with the grown-ups. Oh, but, uh, but, but, Mike, don't, don't you have to get up early in the morning for glee club practice? <laughs> no, no, I quit that. It was lame. Sorry, but I can't live your dream, dad. <laughs> You gonna be my new mommy? <laughs> Liz. Where did you go? You said you wanted to be alone. That means give me five minutes to stop crying. This is Mike's little girlfriend, Liz. <laughs> Hi. They're having a bit of a spat at the moment about the prom or a bake sale or something. Look, look, maybe we should just take this into my room? No, huh? no, no, why bother? I mean, you tell all our friends all our most intimate details. We can talk right in front of them. Sometimes I snort during sex. <laughs> Liz, you have no right to be mad. You told your roommate I was bad at oral. Oh. Oh. oh, kids, what are you gonna do, am I right? This is a completely different situation. How? Because this is about me. Uh, you guys now, I think it's a school night. <laughs> Never fear, Chow is here. <laughs> He's just a local boy from the neighborhood. He's retarded. He thinks he's Superman. <laughs> Why are you here? What happened to your dates? They were psycho. <laughs> and Jed has, has no social filter. <laughs> Look, I just don't think I can trust you anymore. Well, I tell you, I don't trust you, Liz, but you just go blab to Jordan. Mm. Kids, can I say something? Look, I know I don't know you guys, but Take it from someone who's been around a little bit longer. People talk to their friends. Now, you can lie about it and you can make promises you want, but it's gonna happen. It's healthy. She is so freaking hot. <laughs> I do her. <laughs> and you two, if you're really Mike's and Liz's friends, you have to learn how to keep the private things private. We're, We're sorry. sorry. <laughs> are amazing. You're right. She's right. I'm sorry. 
I'm sorry too, and and I'm I'm sorry if I kind of milked the situation a bit with the foot rub and everything. But hey, I you know I don't get to be right that often. Well, if you like being right, maybe you ought to look into actually being right once in a while. It's such a hassle. Lying seemed easier. Yeah, I guess sometimes lying is easier. Like, remember that time I didn't tell you I had sex with you and. <laughs> okay, here's the funny thing you had sex with your son's girlfriend? Well, it was before they met. <laughs> I think I'm gonna leave now. Oh! Oh, don't leave! Who will guide us? <laughs> you know what? I was wrong. I need to date younger men with no kids. Oh, well, this is great, because I'm actually only 25. Right. With that cheap toupee and beer belly. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey, don't worry about her, man. That is the best looking rock I've ever seen.